built-in channel power meter option on the Field Fox is very simple, but incredibly useful, as it makes amplitude measurements with comparable accuracy to a real power meter, but without the need for an external power sensor. This is made possible by Agilent's unique InstaLine technology, so that across the entire operating temperature range of the Field Fox, from minus 10 to plus 55 degrees centigrade, we can measure RF amplitude with a typical accuracy of about half a dB. And best of all, whereas a traditional power sensor always operates across the entire frequency range of the sensor and measures the total power of all signals within that range, the built-in power meter allows the user to set a measurement span or channel bandwidth. This adjustable frequency selectivity allows us to make true averaging power meter measurements in any bandwidth that we select, allowing us to ignore signals that may be present at other frequencies. So here we're still generating a 19.8 GHz spread spectrum carrier, and we've got the set the center frequency to 19.8 gigs. There's a red warning on the screen here, which is just a little reminder that if you're connecting directly to a transmitter, you really ought to think about also inserting an external attenuator. And on the right here, we've set the span or channel width to two megahertz. So that's the bandwidth within which we're measuring the RF power. And as you can see, we've got an analog display here. So if the level of the RF signal is going up or down, we can see that displayed if we're trying to peak an antenna, for example. And below that, we've got the actual RF power measurement in dBm, and it's saying per 2 MHz. In other words, it's minus 15 dBm in our 2 MHz bandwidth. And one final thing I'll point out that's available in both the channel power meter and in the spectrum analyzer options is the radio standard here. If you're working in one of the commercial radio standards such as GSM, WCDMA or whatever, then if you don't know the frequency of the channel you're in, you can just select that radio standard and then enter the frequency by channel number instead of in megahertz. And of course, as with many Agilent instruments, there's still an option for plugging in one of Agilent's U2000 series USB power sensors if you prefer. For further information on the Field Fox Microwave Analyzer, please contact your local representative or visit the website shown below.